Nowadays, technology is virtually a must-have for every teen, whether texting, posting to social media, or video chatting on FaceTime. Teens are using technology every day. So what happens when an entire high school campus welcomes technology on a one-to-one -one basis for every student? We took a closer look on the campus of Porter High School in New Caney ISD. I like that you could go home and if you're absent, you have homework and it'll be sent to you. I think the great thing about having the the one-to-one, -one, having each student with technology in their hand is that it really does connect us. So from the counseling um, side of things, uh, regardless of a student's financial situation um, or their ability to own that kind of technology, they do have it in their hands. They can share it with their parents. Um, things like checking grades, things like even as simple as a schedule, um, they can look up on their Chromebook, they can find out what their schedule is, what their grades are, what their assignments are, so that can never be an excuse for a student anymore. In addition to that, um, we're able to create documents, you know, mandated documents, for example, the personal graduation plan. And we can create that, we can share it one-on-one -on -one with that student, we can open it up and have discussions, uh, we can talk to the parent about that personal graduation plan. So really, the communication and the connection with the student is really terrific. I think it bridges the gap, the digital divide gap that we have, and it equals the playing field for all students and success for all, which is what we're all about in education. So what do the students think about the new Chromebooks? Well, uh, first of all, it has, it has improved my school and work life, like the work that I do at school here by 100%, 1,000% even, because it's, it's, it's just a real benefit in my life to have it here. It's made a huge difference at the school. It's really improved the work production of our students. It's helped with research papers, it's helped with creating PowerPoints or videos or any kind of project that needs to be done in the classroom. Um, one of the other things with the implementation of Google Classroom, we are able to um, instantly, um, students when they're absent, um, that's a non-issue. Uh, if they're at home and maybe able to work or not, they always know what's expected because it's in Google Classroom, they can log on, uh, look at the assignments that the teacher has posted. Um, teachers usually now, uh, their deadline as opposed to having it at the, uh, 4 o'clock at the end of the day, they're able to, um, they give a midnight deadline. Uh, so that it's time stamped and they're able to uh, give their work in. Students are particularly uh, good about that. The teachers are more connected to the students now. And even, yeah. if, even if the student misses a day of class, they no longer have an excuse to miss work because that work is still sent to them on Google Classroom and exactly. stuff like that. And that's the same with working in the group for you exactly. know your, your students. And um, one of the biggest uh, um, tools that we can use is like in Google Docs or in PowerPoint, you're able to comment or talk with the students within that you know in that document. You can also make changes while all of y'all are in this in the same document. It's really it's really convenient and is really beneficial when it comes to making that work happen. So. One thing that um, I particularly love on the administrative side is when students have concerns, they email me. Um, we, I have uh, daily correspondence with, with students about their uh, academic concerns, which is what we want. We want them to buy into their own education. They feel free. They email me uh, daily. I have uh, daily emails from students that I'm able to interact with, offer them advice, um, direct them to the right person. One of the things that um, is a huge advantage for being one-to-one, -one, um, we are, uh, from this time last year, we have cut paper. Um, our use of paper in half. And so we have really um, moved towards a paperless environment. Regardless of the reasons, one thing's for sure, their Chromebooks are affecting the atmosphere at school. The teachers have their, in the classrooms, their classes are grouped um, by groups. Uh, rarely will you see in our, in our uh, classrooms rows uh, of, of desks. They're all in groups and collaborating and working together. Um, and I, um, I, that is from, uh, from our Google Classroom work and um, just teachers uh, wanting students to have that real life experience of sharing. Tell us what you think about going one-to-one -one with Chromebooks. Tweet your thoughts to at Spartan News PHS. We'll pick one lucky viewer to win a Sonic gift card. Good luck. And remember, at Spartan News, your story matters.